Welcome to Jackets Required. Hello, I'm Dominic Lacquanini, designer and tailor. This week's episode of Jackets Required wraps up a three-part series on alterations. We talked about having pants, altering them through the waist, and today I'm going to dig into the details of altering jackets properly. Altering a jacket requires resetting of the blades and sleeves. Taking in a jacket or letting it out can throw off the entire balance of the garment. How do we avoid this unsightly mess is with a proper alteration. We unsew the seams and either sew in new seams further into the jacket to make it smaller or further out towards the edge to make it larger. If you alter any proportion of the garment, it will throw off other areas off balance. So in essence, we deconstruct the jacket and create a new pattern for it to be sewn back together with the new proper proportions. If you're altering the shoulder or chest, this involves removing and recutting the front and back panels. This also requires moving the lining and recutting and resewing that as well. It takes many hours of a skilled hand sewn work to accomplish flawlessly. If you're letting out a jacket and it's an off the rack type of garment, then you may run into the challenge of not having enough fabric to let out. Most off the rack suits are made with little extra. Being precise in what fabric you use cuts costs for them and they are not concerned about custom fitting to every body type within the size range. Here's where one large benefit bespoke jackets come into play, as your tailor will make your custom suit with extra fabric in order to accommodate the long lifespan of the garment and the natural changes you may experience in your own body over the years. A great jacket is always worth keeping and a touch of alteration here and there is a great way to keep it looking its best on you no matter what. If you're going to invest in your clothing, make sure it's an investment that will last through time. Go custom from the beginning and you'll have a lot more flexibility with the garment going forward, ensuring a long life for it and a lot of enjoyment by you. Hopefully I've shed some light on the behind the scenes of what it takes to make a solid quality alteration to your jacket and the amount of skill craftsmanship that it actually really requires. Be sure to subscribe to Jacket Required YouTube channel and Facebook page to be notified when new episodes are available and to see behind the scenes pictures and clips. Share with your stylish and style challenge friends and be sure to let me know if you have any specific questions or topics you'd like to see here in the series. Thanks for watching. See you next week. And remember, looking good is between you and your tailor. Ciao.